Hi there everybody, on today's video I have this uh, Honda Accord 2004 and uh, we're just gonna have a quick look at the location of the fuses so according to the manual here um, there's two fuse boxes and this is um, a petrol, this is a 2.4 petrol because the manual also shows you the diesel diesel version but we are looking at the petrol version and they're probably very similar anyway so we have an interior one an interior fuse box and that is uh, driver's lower outside so it's on the panel on the driver's side and then under the bonnet we have that which is uh, located near the back of the engine compartment on the left side to open it, push the tabs as shown. Uh, diesel version is also close to the um, back of the engine there. Um, the manual also shows you a layout of the fuses and on vehicles with VSA under the bonnet, fuse and relay box so you have uh, the fuses there, you got the numbers and then you have the, the list down there now the back of the cover may actually have um, a list of the fuses as well but we'll have a look at that otherwise you will need your manual um, now this is, like I said, on vehicles with VSA, that's vehicle stability uh, assist or something like that. Um, most Hondas have VSA, this Honda has VSA, it's a 2004. Uh, but if yours doesn't have vehicles without VSA then you also have a slightly different layout of fuses. But they are in the same place and that is the uh, the interior fuse box there a lot of window controls and seat controls key cigarette lighter screen wash engine and so on and uh, that's sort of the list that they show you there So, not all fuses will be available, not all fuses will be there on the slots um, and that just depends on the, what features your vehicle has. If you have electric seats, then you'll probably have the fuses for the, uh, for the seats. But if you don't have electric seats, those fuses won't be there. Uh, now this, this area uh, concentrates on the diesel model, again it's just a list of how they are placed so um, on this particular car and this engine if you look here on the right hand side there's this little box if you press on these uh, tabs here you can pull that cover out so yes the back of this cover does have a list of the fuses and some relays that is um, so you can refer to this but obviously yeah, the manual is always probably a bit more detailed if you don't know what the symbols are um, and there is also um, a couple of relays or fuses that are sitting on on those two boxes there there's one little box here and there's another one here
So there's a little fuse in there and a relay. And this particular one is showing me 20 amp, 20 amps, and it's got the picture of a seat of the back of the seat that tilts back and forth. So this, this car does have uh, that function. And this other one, that other one is got um, a fuse for the tailgate. And that's a 40 amp fuse, tailgate motor, and also it says closer motor. That's a 20 amp fuse in there. And so that's pretty much uh, for the fuses um, in the engine bay. So now we can have a look at the fuses um, inside of the car, in the interior. So, driver's side. And this in the uh, outer panel footwell area here. you will find this little cover here just above the uh, bonnet release if you pull it towards you that will come out and that will reveal um, your fuses there and again there is a list of fuses behind the panel they are numbered and they got the amperage so you can't go missing with that so again not all fuses are in the slots and that's just because of the functions certain functions are not available And that's it so um, I hope this video helps and uh, thanks for watching